Hi, welcome. Thank you for tuning in. My name is Marius Rodenberg. This time I would like to introduce you to the painting and photo storyboard I made with a swan song as theme. The size of the photo is 1.05 meters by 70 centimeters. We are witness to a tragic separation that is taking place. A loss. A final call. A goodbye to all that has been. No more can be endured. There where love kept life going, the ultimate shock has set in, followed by the swan's song. This composition showed up in me when I was at a loss for words. It expressed the loss of a loved one combined with complete and utter devastation. The swan to the left is seated on a tree trunk that is broken off above the roots, symbolizing that something that has been built up through time into a solid, secure and colorful feeling has broken down. This swan has a twofold meaning. Firstly, being the previous partner of the swan to the right, in awe of so much distress. And secondly, a mirror to the swan on the right, strengthening the feeling of exhaustion and being the final thing one can take. The swan to the right is standing as upright as he can and stretches his wings forward. He has extended his neck to the full in order to force out the last bit of breath of agonizing pain before succumbing to it. In the front of the composition a very delicate situation is taking place with traffic in the background which is a harsh contrast. The contrast with on the one hand the extreme devastation which feels like life is standing still and should stay standing still. And yet on the other hand all keeps moving on which causes a feeling of friction resulting in confusion. It leaves a feeling of loneliness being anesthetized, exhaustion and suffocation. In the meantime the water in the foreground expresses the natural flow of events, a delicate movement. In the background you see the man-made world of asphalt, cars and a lorry, the rough side of things. The shade between the swans flows towards the horizon and evaporates, meaning this striking situation will eventually move on, just like life does. For me the painting became an altarpiece evoking all the distress and at the same time silence, understanding and peace. A mirror for healing. For the photo storyboard I wanted to extend that feeling of having a vast open landscape creating a feeling of loneliness. All is quiet, strengthening the anesthetized feeling. The overhanging clouded sky accentuates the intimacy and intensity of the situation. One could see the reflection of the reeds in the tranquil flowing water as memories. Reeds usually move to and fro even in a light breeze, but are now standing still. The man who has travelled through life for quite some time is lying on the couch in all his vulnerability. He is turned towards the painting. In the context of the overall composition, he expresses a broken man finding consolation in the expression of the painting, which is placed as an altarpiece above the couch. The couch floats in the water as the man moves through the flow of life's events. Having been in this situation, it at the same time gives the opportunity to go through it and beyond. That's what gave me the insight and strength to do so will be the theme of a painting and photo storyboard. Thank you for joining in. Take care.